Good morning. It is Monday, October 14th, and I was selected to participate in a test knit by Thorson Knits, and I believe the pattern is, the pattern is called On the Double Raglan, so I'm going to get started on that today. My yarn arrived yesterday. Um, I ordered this off of Amazon, paid for it myself. It's not like sponsored or anything, but I'm going to use Patton's Classic Wool in the color Claret. And it's a beautiful red, and I think it's gonna be perfect coloring for the holidays coming up. And um, I've been actually really excited to sign up this, for this test knit for a while because I've seen um, her post the, the pictures of the pattern previously, um, and now it's finally ready to test knit. So I'm gonna make the fourth size, which I believe is D. Yeah and it's for a 40 to 42 inch bust. So I'm gonna get started on that today. I already got my needles ready. Um, yeah, I'm gonna get started. Goodness, go, no, no. <laughs> Don't try to nibble on my knitting, weasel. You guys are ridiculous. All right, so I had gone inside and cast it on the collar. And this is actually a pretty interesting neckline for, uh, for like a collar. Um, this is the first time I've knitted a collar where you don't do ribbing. Um, so for the, and I didn't realize that before this, I guess maybe I didn't look at the picture close enough, but you just knit. Um, it's gonna be a fold over collar, I believe. Um, a, a, like a kind of a wider fold over collar. So yeah, it's very interesting. I casted it on and now I'm just gonna kind of knit away. What I'm thinking I might do in a little bit is put on, uh, a Harry Potter marathon while I knit because I've been kind of wanting to have my own little Harry Potter marathon to go through all of the movies so that's kind of I might knit for a little bit outside first but it might be I could probably do quite a bit today if I just put on some movies and knit away while I listen so that's kind of what I'm thinking I might do. All right, I watched through the first Harry Potter movie and I got this far. I think there's about four inches of the collar done. So that's my progress. I'm hoping to finish the collar today and maybe a little bit into the yoke, but I definitely want to at least try to finish this collar. I really love this color. The color of this yarn is so pretty. I think I started this around seven or eight. This morning, it is a little bit after 11. I did have to do some, like, I paused the movie a couple times to do stuff um, here and there, but yeah, this is where I am. I'm going to continue knitting away. I have, uh, I have a bit more to go, 
but I think I might be able to at least finish the collar today. I'm probably going to stop knitting around three um, because I will have to make dinner and, you know, take care of stuff around here, but that's my plan. I think for dinner I'm going to make some ribs and with some potatoes. That's my plan. That sounds like a good dinner. Hi, I'm Adala. You're such a sweet girl. You're so silly. Alright, I'm gonna get back to knitting now. So it is 6 p.m. now, and I finished the collar. So it looks like this. And then I just did the row where I place the stitch markers, which marks where the raglan increases go. And um, I just also began the round or the row where you kind of work on the right side to the wrong side for the neck shaping. So this is the progress. The color is so nice. This is a nice, interesting color. And I'm excited to see how this turns out. But I'm gonna keep working on this tonight while I'm in bed before I go to sleep. But I think I'll end this video for the progress for today at the moment and then we can do an update on how much I do tomorrow. Well, good morning. Um, my day's been a little bit thrown off because my phone stopped working. I was working on editing this video this morning of what I knitted yesterday. I'm gonna do a quick update of what I knitted last night before bed, but um, as I was editing the video this morning, I noticed color flashing and my phone and I looked at my phone and like the screen just was going berserk. So my phone, which I film with generally, eh, it's not usable. <laughs> um, but I did find my old previous phone and I charged it up and hello turkeys. That's what I'm using right now so I can finish this video. But I'm gonna do a quick update to show you how much progress I made on the um, on the double raglan. There's also a bunch of road work being done. I guess they're resealing our road today and uh, in two days for now. But basically, I did finish the collar, which I was really happy with, and then I also finished the neck shaping. So now from here, I'm just gonna be doing the raglan increases. So I did make quite a bit of progress here. It looks so good. Um, I don't know what my turkeys are doing right now. They're just standing in front of me. What are you doing? Okay, anyway, so this is the progress I made. I was hoping to be knitting on this by now. It's it's like 10 a.m. the next day now that I've gotten around to filming this part, showing the update of what I knitted last night. I haven't knitted on this at all this morning. You can't peck my sweater. This brown turkey is, oh my gosh, it just pecked my tripod. Anyways, so some things have happened and stop it. Don't peck my tripod. 
So some things have happened to derail my knitting plans for the day. I don't know if I'll knit today because I kind of wanted to like film the process. My turkeys are right here in front of me. <laughs> um, but anyways, that's where I am. We might have to go to T-Mobile today to figure out either if they can fix what's going wrong with my screen because I didn't drop it today. It didn't get wet. It just randomly, I had, I wasn't even using it or listening to anything on it, but the screen just started flashing like black and white and getting green lines across it, even though I hadn't done anything that could have damaged it this morning. Um, and it worked just fine this morning before that. Like I was on my, I was on the phone with my husband on his way home uh, to work and it worked just fine. And then I was editing my video look down and the screen's just flashing and unusable. <laughs> Anyways, that's going to be it for this video. Um, so this is the progress that I made on the first um, day of working on this test knit. And um, that's where we are. You can probably, you might possibly be able to hear the road work happening now as well. I don't know. It's pretty loud. Um, so that Stop! Why are you trying to eat my hair? Oh my gosh. These birds are ridiculous. Okay. I'm gonna go now. For now. <laughs> Thank you for joining me and I hope you have a good day. Okay, bye.